All right, let's get to the player you're most excited to watch here in this tournament. It's Keegan Murray out of Iowa. I just left the Big Ten tournament in Indy, and he convinced me that he's not the best prospect, but he's the best player in the country, okay? And this is a guy who averaged seven points a game as a freshman. He had one D1 offer out of high school, but I love his versatility, okay? 6'8", and you can run him off of screens like this. He's a lights-out shooter, 40% from threes, and the top five in the entire country in scoring. Oh, and then he can handle as well. He's a modern forward. He can push on the break. And then look at the bounce here. Ooh, the length, 7'1", wingspan, 6'8", really fits that modern NBA. So he can shoot it from three, he can handle, he can get his own. Oh, and then he does the little things as well. Watch this, okay? Look at him read the ball from the corner, and then the game-winning wow. tap-in. Like, that's length, that's athleticism, that's instincts, that's presence of mind. And what I love about him, above all else, he is a silent assassin. Think Tim Duncan, Kawhi Leonard. Okay. Shot in your face, shot in your face, shot in your face. No smile, yeah. no celebration, stone-cold killer. Interestingly enough, we just came off a Spurs uh, feature about Greg Popovich, so who knows? Maybe who the knows? Spurs can be in that particular area and they get lucky with him and get another silent assassin like those guys. Who's the guy whose stock could rise the most potentially in the lottery with a good tournament? I think it's Jaden Ivey out of Purdue, and he's the most dynamic electric guard in the entire country. We have him mocked in the top five right now, but if he leads Purdue to a final four, you might hear his name up at number two, number three, and it's the speed, it's the explosiveness, slow and relaxed to boom, shot out of a cannon. So think Russell Westbrook type of frame, but Ja Morant type of burst, okay? I remember being at this game at the OBC tournament. I also just watched Jaden Ivey out of the Big Ooh. Ten tournament. The bounce, the slow to fast, the burst, the shiftiness, there are some similarities, and the pick and roll pace as well. The cross jab, getting wow. downhill, the setup. He studied John Morant because his mom, Niall Ivey, coached John Morant his rookie year in Memphis. Wow. So he is meticulously looking at every single move John Morant makes in pick and roll. Now, he needs to improve his floor game. He needs to improve his tenacity defensively because Ja, he's a connector. Yeah. He's a guy you want to be around. You want to battle. You want to fight for. You want to go to war for. Jay Nivey, we're still figuring that out about him. Yeah, no question about it. I mean, that it's just incre incredible stuff in this tournament. I think it's going to be a wide-open tournament. I can't wait to see more of it. And I'm sure we'll have more breakdowns from you coming up over the next couple of weeks, man. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks Always so appreciate, it. appreciate it. I want to be this guy when I grow up. He travels all around the world. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.